Kate Middleton's sister is engaged to hedge fund guy James Matthew. It is believed up to 3,000 photos of the Duchess of Cambridge's sister have been stolen, including images of Prince George and Princess Charlotte. In a statement issued by her lawyers, Ms Middleton confirmed her account had been unlawfully accessed. Her people say the hackers are trying to have the photos published in exchange for money. An anonymous seller, calling themselves Mass, has reportedly contacted media organizations claiming they had 3,000 private photos from Miss Middleton's Apple iCloud account. The collection purportedly includes photos of parties, wedding dresses and the royal children. It is not yet known who is behind the hack. According to the Daily Mail, the seller added, Due to current climate on privacy laws in the UK I'm intending a quick US sale but would at least give you a heads up. Ms Middleton, 33, and her fiancé James Matthews have asked for their privacy to be respected in light of the hack. The revelation comes after Yahoo yesterday confirmed a massive attack on its network in late 2014 affected 500 million users and was likely state-sponsored. The internet giant said the stolen information included names, email addresses, phone numbers, dates of birth, passwords and, in some cases, encrypted or unencrypted security questions and answers. The company said its investigation turned up no evidence that hackers got credit card data or bank account information, saying it doesn't store that information on the affected network. Yahoo believes that information associated with at least 500 million user accounts was stolen and the investigation has found no evidence that the state-sponsored actor is currently in Yahoo's network, the company said in a statement. Yahoo is working closely with law enforcement on this matter. Also yesterday, the White House confirmed a scan of First Lady Michelle Obama's passport appears to have made its way online. The fresh disclosures, which included emails to and from White House staffers, raised further concerns about the security of sensitive systems following a string of breaches affecting government agencies, private companies and the Democratic National Committee.